una prueba que el mundo a mí nunca me brindó Quería casarme, yo tan loco en ilusionarme Creyendo en tus besos y tus caricias, la verdad no fue el culpable Ay, Todo tiene un propósito y dejarme será solo uno más Siempre a medias no he logrado encontrar mi otra mitad Hi beautiful, welcome back to another Lita video. If you are new, please subscribe and join the Lita family here on YouTube. I really would love to have you. So I started by pushing the cuticle back. My client is gonna wash her hands, I'm gonna wash my hands, and we're gonna start with clean hands, okay? Then we push the cuticle back, and we're basically, we're making room on the nail plate. We wanna make sure we make enough room since we're starting in this case, we're starting with a very small nail bed, or I should say nail plate, um, nail area. <laughs> and we want to make sure that we expose the new growth and have enough space there to work with. And also, I want to make sure I want to lift any dead skin that's attached to the nail plate. And this way, when I go through with the sanding band, I can get all of it off and I'm focusing especially on the nail grooves and the sidewalls and I also want to remove the shine from the natural nail okay then we're gonna go in and spray with some isopropyl alcohol I have been asked in the past I've got a couple questions if you could use alcohol drinking alcohol and vodka I know that's funny but no you shouldn't I mean if you try it let me know if it works and probably would work but I wouldn't recommend it so yeah <laughs> and then when we go in with these tips I did get these tips on Amazon they're specifically for me in my opinion made for very small nails because when I tried to like even the pinkies I don't know they just didn't fit me as well as they fit her so these would be really good if you have really small nail beds and I will leave all of the links all of this stuff's going to be in my storefront so if you guys are curious um, but yeah, you want to make sure that the nail tips fit sidewall to sidewall. And I am using a brush on glue, which I forgot to show. It is by Young Nails. And I feel like it just makes it easier when it's brush on because it's a little bit more precise. <laughs> So I went in and I I literally just cut off the tip of the nail tips because we wanted them to be long. We wanted to keep the length. And I do use scissors because I feel like it's easier. Someone asked me why I didn't use, um, or not why I didn't use it, but if they could use just nail clippers. And the reason why you really can't is if you wanted to cut off more of the nail tip you would need to use either a nail tip cutter or scissors just because the nail clippers will only go up so far and then you would end up having to like cut one side and then the other i mean you can do it but i think it's easier and faster if you just use a nail tip cutter or uh, scissors because sometimes you cut the sides right when you get to the thumb it's so thick you have to kind of twist it and then it bends the nail tip and it i don't know it's just easier trust me use the scissors or a nail tip cutter if you have one and it'll make your life a lot easier so i went in with a straight edge file and i used the 100 grit side to file the nail tips and then um what else now i'm going in with like i said before with the sanding band to kind of blend everything and again i go in with isopropyl alcohol not the other alcohol I go in again, I eliminate all of the dust and debris, and I'm also dehydrating all at the same time because, believe it or not, those things, if they're sitting on your nail plate or your nail bed, 
it's supposed to be plate. I guess that's the top part of your nail. Um, and it gets in between the acrylic and the nail. I feel like that can cause lifting as well. So let's not forget about that. So if we want to be picky about it, remove all of that, use some isopropyl alcohol, cleanse it, get rid of it. It also dehydrates it. And then I go in with JC Beauty Concepts dehydrator and primer. And I use two coats of primer that helps tons. I'm using JC Beauty Concepts number 12 um, brush and let's see i'm using epiphany jc beauty concepts epiphany and then the number 74 yes everything is jc beauty concepts and the monomer so you guys know i have a coupon code jammy 15 you guys know i love jc beauty concepts and then what else what else oh and another thing was that i stood up to get some paper towel and realized i wasn't recording um when i was done because i go to check like making sure i'm still in frame and whatnot and I wasn't recording. So thankfully, you guys know I, I just record usually the one hand because yeah, you've already seen all the steps on one hand. Just try to make the video short. And, um, but thankfully I caught it and I just said, I'll just record this hand and explain. Back to the acrylic. So when applying acrylic, you guys know, I've always said you wanna angle the finger down, allow gravity to help you, point the finger down, place the acrylic, very close to the cuticle without touching it and allow the acrylic to run down and then kind of guide it with your brush downward and this will avoid flooding sometimes it happens you want to make sure you wipe it though and seal it so that you know you can avoid the lifting of course and then also on the nails that i apply glitter acrylic i do go in with a thin layer of clear acrylic on her nail plate or nail bed I don't know. I don't know why that's been bothering me lately, just because it's your nail plate that's up at the top. <laughs> and we always say nail bed, but it's your nail plate. And then um, I go in with the glitter just so that, I don't know, if you want to remove it, um, there is a clear layer protecting your nail bed. Nail plate. Got it? Okay. I think that's all I have for now. Hopefully those tips are helpful. And then I'll come back after I apply the acrylic. Oiga, oiga, señorita, quisiera decirle solo una cosita, que mi corazón todavía palpita, pa' que no lo dañes, que ahí es donde tú habitas, tú no estás de visita. Ella sabe que sin montar que tenga mejor nada, wey. la lealtad es algo que ella no aprecia, no le interesa nada de nada de nada. Ella sabe que sin montar que tenga mejor nada, wey. la lealtad es algo que ella no ya no le interesa nada de nada de nada Me dice que me ama cuando hay nubes grises Pero me saluda más las olas del mar Ella es muy bipolar con tantos matices Cuando dice que está bien piensa que está mal Todo era bonito cuando lo hacía contigo te pido amor como si fuera un mendigo Y para ser bien claro que despidan a Cupido Y te traigan pica pica pa' tus supuestos amigos Como quieras Y si quieres lo hacemos a tu manera Y solitico nos dañamos el corazón Duele bien cabrón Pero no importa ya no vale la pena Ella sabe que sin montar que tenga mejor nada wey. La lealtad es algo que ella no aprecia No le interesa nada de nada de nada
Muchos rumores, mucha gente que comenta yeah. Yo sé que estás pa' mí, nunca vas a estar en venta Quiero volverme viejito contigo a los 60 Solo contigo, bebé Solo contigo, bebé Que ponga nuestra canción So really quickly, I'm just gonna go in with a thin layer of clear acrylic and cap all of the nails. No sé qué tú ves en mí, mi amor Ya no dejes de mirarme Que ya me gusta quién soy Contigo me siento en control Eres el balance en este mundo poco humor Se volvió ese chico que habló en mis canciones Esas madrugadas que So now I'm going in with a straight edge file again using the 100 grit side. This is going to help me redefine the shape since I've lost some of it from the acrylic and wiping the sides and you know, you know how that goes. So just going to reshape and redefine my side walls and my nail tip. <laughs> De lo que nadie quería Si eres pop para mis poesías Te toca tú solo sabes Si el pico comparte maldades Pero sin ser Ah, verdadero, baby Si el pico 
que tú solo sabes Momentos que siento reales Yo lo prefiero que en un largo tiempo sea tu caballero Tú me ves como nadie más bebe Me diste alas para que vuele Pero motivos para que vuele, pero motivos para quedarme, tú me ves. All right, so now I'm going in with Kiara Sky's fine five-in-one bit, and I'm using this bit to remove any bulk acrylic or any acrylic that might be trapped underneath the nail tip, redefining the tip, and also sealing the acrylic up at the cuticle. I basically use this bit to do most of the hard work that I would do if I was just hand filing. And then once I'm done with that, I go in with a hand file because I like to finish with a hand file just to redefine shape and smooth everything out. And that would be my last, like my finishing for the set. And then I go in and buff, but you will see that later yo me muero por una prueba de placer siempre que estoy a tu lado lo que siento nadie más lo podrá saber vamos y sin censura yo te hago todo a ti dulzura que pasó en tu yo solo cuenta todo y si tú quieres te pone a buscar Como tú lo mueves a pa pam pam, haciendo locura en la mañana. Si alguien te pregunta no pasa nada, solo amaneciste en mi cama. Dale besame, ven y atrápame, hagamos jueguitos que de chiquito no pude hacer. Dale besame, ven y atrápame, que So I went in with the hand file as you saw and I sealed everything, made sure everything was nice and smooth. Now I'm going in with the buffer, especially on the corners. I don't want them to be too sharp for her. And yeah, just smoothing everything out for a nail art. And I hope you guys enjoy the end result. I did. I thought it was a huge transformation. She loves them. I love them. I thought they turned out really pretty. Let me know what you think. And I hope you guys are doing good. I've missed you guys. And I really do hope that you guys are doing well and are in a good place. Because that's very important to be good in a good mental place. And, um, you know, healthy. 
and happy and you know it's okay to think of ourselves sometimes and take time for ourselves so that we can be okay and then we'll be better for others all right so i love you guys so much thank you for being here as always and i will see you guys on the next video bye En la habitación, que rico mami. Pero en cosas del amor, mucho fallaba. No había nada, mi amor, algo esperaba de tu mirada. Pero Dios se la que siento. Si fuiste mi mujer Por lo que yo he visto y lo que te gusta Amor, tú tu vida yo no voy a hacer Dame una noche, te voy a demostrar Que soy el pecado que amas cometer eh, Chica, y si tú quisieras Una sola vez Conmigo hay que ser claro Lo que quieres ver Ya pasó tu primavera Nada cariño, solo pretexto Estaría fine si lo lloré Y no llenarás de fantasías Ya me dijiste lo que quería No eran besos ni poesía Qué chica y si tú quisieras Una sola vez Conmigo hay que ser claro lo que quieras Stop.